We begin in Mali, where the country's president, Ibrahim Boubacar Keita, on Saturday visited people injured in Friday's gun attack on one of the Malian capital stop hotels that left 19 people dead, including two gunmen. And speaking to reporters briefly after visiting the hotel on Saturday, President Keita said the attack underscored the global threat posed by Islamic extremists, especially coming just one week after teams of attackers from the Islamic State group in Paris killed 130 people while targeting a stadium, a concert hall, cafes and restaurants. We are in a period right now where we all have to be ready. We do not want to see this kind of events. But in a world that is secure today, where such things can even happen to a well-prepared capital like Paris, with all its abilities and competency, no one is safe. 